guys? It's your girl Dez. E Dizzy. <laughs> What's up, it's your girl Dizzy, and I'm back at it again with another video. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And then we're just gonna jump right into the video. I don't really know what I'm filming today, honestly. I just wanted to film because I was like, why not, you know? So I'm just gonna film a basic little, you know, basic little beat, little slight beat or whatever. I'm actually gonna try my foundation routine differently because I did this the other day and I actually really liked it. But then when I tried to do it again, it just came out all kinds of wrong. So I'm gonna try it again today and then we just gonna, you know, go from there. But I'm gonna talk to y'all because, you know, I never talk to y'all when I'm doing my makeup. But uh, just gotta order. Just gotta order. Hey, hey, just gotta order. Okay. Um, I'll fulfill that in just a sec when I finish doing this. But yeah, so what's up? Like, what's tea? Like, what's good? What's popping? My cousin told me, so I'm talking to my cousin yesterday, right? And she said, she was like, I like watching up and coming YouTubers. And I was like, you never watch my shit. <laughs> and she was like, that's because you be trying to act all proper and stuff on here. And I'm like, I don't want to act proper. I mean, she was like, you don't act like yourself. You don't act goofy. And like, honestly, it's not that I don't act like myself. It's just that. I'm not used to being in front of the camera just yet. So, like, it's hard for my personality to show through the camera, I guess. That's, I think that's what I'm going to say. Because the reason I say that is because I'm, like, if you see me in person or if you meet me in person, I'm very, like, goofy. Like, I'm always laughing, like, I'm always making jokes or whatever the case may be. But um, it's kind of hard to show that on camera because usually when I'm making jokes, I'm talking to somebody. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know why I did my face like that. But yeah, usually when I'm um, usually when I'm making a joke or something, I'm talking to somebody. And so me being on camera and just trying to talk and be funny is kind of like. Mm, because it's like I feed off of other people's energy and I can't really feel y'all energy right now. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, it's kind of hard. This, this YouTube life is hard. Um, but yeah, so that's my goal is to try to show more of my personality because I'm really a fun person. Like, I mean, are you that? Are you that? So, I think I'm going to talk about something. I'm going to talk about something, but I'm going to talk about something. I'm going to piggyback off of what I'm about to say right now. So, um, I've been thinking about, you know, just my life and <laughs> how it's in shambles. No, it's not in shambles, but i just been thinking about, like, what I want to do next, like, with my channel and just, you know, stuff in general. And I... I have like kind of shifted, not really shifted, but like my mind hasn't really been f like focused on YouTube more so lately. I've been like more so just trying to get my business. Sorry. Trying to get my business to a point where I don't have to actually work anymore. Um, So I've been going through a lot of like, you know, anybody who has a business or runs a business you know like the little emotions that you go through like one day you're in one day you're out one day you're like what the hell am i doing why am i still doing this kind of thing um but nevertheless you know you gotta keep pushing you gotta keep it keep it going don't give up but yeah so i'm like at a place where i'm just like okay what how can i incorporate my business into my youtube so that way i'm not actually abandoning 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 is that the word my youtube channel so I think I'm gonna actually incorporate more like business stuff, like entrepreneur vlogs, because I watch a lot of those, like entrepreneur vlogs and stuff like that into my um into my channel. So that way it's like it's like the best of both worlds kind of thing, you know. Where it's like I don't have to actually just be like, okay, well today we're fo we're focusing strict, we're focusing on business today, and then you know, 
Y'all, I think faster than I talk. So sometimes I stutter over myself. I hate that. But um, yeah, so I think I'm gonna do slide more business stuff on my page. Um, and then I just been also thinking about like ways to kind of like rebrand myself because at one point, like I'm not even like no cap. Like I'm not even, I'm not even trying to cap right now. Like I was popping at one point, you feel me? And like not popping in the sense of like, oh my gosh, I'm this big celebrity, but it's just like I had more engagement with my audience. I feel like I don't post enough for me to actually um, gain, like have that retention. Like if I post something, sorry, it's something on my eye. I think I got it. So yeah, like if I post something, it's like, okay, she posted after three months. It, when is she going to post again type thing? So I just feel like people are like not even checking for me anymore. You know what I'm saying? And people would be checking for me. You know what I'm saying? Like if it was, if I was just like a regular schmegala nine to five kind of gal, you know what I'm saying? And no, I'm not saying anything is wrong with working nine to five. Dang, because I've been seeing that debate all over the fucking internet, dude. I am tired of it. I am tired. But yeah, so not that I'm saying there's anything wrong with working a nine to five, but what I'm trying to do, like, obviously I want to eventually quit my job. So um, I need people checking for me and ain't nobody checking for you if you're not posting. Like there's, there's 10,000 plus other people doing exactly what I'm doing. So why the hell am I going to check for her? And she don't even post. You know what I'm saying? So that is my goal to just kind of like get back on it because I feel like I've abandoned my duties a little bit, you feel me? So that's what I want to get back into doing, you know, posting more. So I've been trying to like, I've been trying to give you guys like interesting like content and stuff, but, content, but I want to stay true to myself. Like I don't want to go out here and make all these friends just because i want something to post or i just want you get what i'm saying like i'm just that's just not me like i'm really like a laid back like i can stay in the house chill with my baby all day like that's the kind of girl that i am so yeah i'm kind of boring that's my problem i'm kind of boring but when it's time to tee up i know how to tee up but i'm really kind of boring like because i got this motto like go big or go home and lately i ain't been able to go big so i'm just stay home that's, that's what I've been doing. I just, I can't be one of those girls that go out and cat for the internet and then you don't got no food in your refrigerator. Like, I got a whole child. Like, I can't be out here trying to cat for y'all. Like, Instagram, Snapchat, um, and Twitter were like my life. Like, literally, if I'm cooking, if I'm using the bathroom, like, I'm on Snapchat, I'm on Twitter. I'm like, letting y'all know. And people was engaged. Like, I had a few people tell me, like, oh my God, your life is like a movie. And I'm like, for real, it ain't even that exciting. Like, people was actually following me and watching my stuff. But now it's just like, since I kind of went MIA and I stopped posting, it's like, they just, you know, went elsewhere. And I'm trying to get y'all back. I'm trying to get y'all back on my side. So, come on. But, uh, yeah, so follow me on Instagram. I said all that just to say follow me on Instagram. <laughs> follow me on Instagram. Um, and we're going to get a pop in or whatever. So I'm going to actually start a um, business series, like, on my YouTube channel. Like, an entrepreneur series. I'm actually going to film my first video for that when I finish this tutorial. Well, not tutorial, but just this chat, chit chat, get ready with me, where the hell have I been type of ordeal, whatever the heck I'm going to call this video. But yeah, I'm going to film that when I finish um, with this video and just kind of, so that's just going to be like my first video, my intro. Because I actually, like, I do stuff on, on the daily basis. Like, I'm doing stuff. I'm constantly doing stuff. But it's, like, business related. And I just feel like that's boring to y'all. And I feel like my series is going to be helpful because, like, I see a lot of people with the entrepreneur, like, series or whatever. But it doesn't highlight the downs. And I've been taking a lot of L's lately when, <laughs> when it comes to my business. And I'm not ashamed to say that because, you know another l for every l that i took it was a lesson learned so it ain't like i'm taking l's and i'm just like fuck this i'm giving up no i'm learning from my l's so as long as you're learning then you know you're good but um 
Yeah, I feel like people coming for my neck now, honey. Like, uh-uh. It's only room for one Dez, period. Well, my name is Desi, but you can call me Desi Dez, whatever. But, um, yeah, so I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to give y'all another try-on haul. See, the thing is with them try-on hauls is I done dang on. Okay, so the first try-on haul, y'all don't know, but I struggled making that even... Even making that video just because, like, I didn't have the right lens that I needed. And then, like, my room isn't, like, the room that I feel, oh, 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 oh. the room, <laughs> the room that I film in is not that big. So, in, in order for me to get my whole body, I needed a new lens. So, I ordered that lens, but I have yet to film another trial haul. I have yet to even wear any more clothes. So, and I think that lens was like $300, $400. So, I'm, like, I'm just out here wasting money. That's why I said I got to get back, get it together. Like, I got to figure out a way to merge the two. Maybe I need to make like a schedule or something. Whereas like, you know, I'm going to film, for sure film on these days. Like, my nose very, 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 very chiseled. Like a mummy. Like a mummy monster. Hmm, yeah, I like that. Like that. Yeah, like that. So, anybody that knows me knows that I like to talk, okay? And I will talk your head off. But lately, the only thing I've been wanting to talk about is business. Like, if you, if you don't got no business mindset, I can't be your friend. I've had a lot of like toxic friends and then like looking back on it, it's just like, dang, this, this person was very toxic. So now that I'm focusing on me and my business, if, you know, just get in where you fit in, baby. Okay, so I did my lashes off camera um, because I, I stuck up in lashes on, on camera. But the lashes that I have on are from my company Posh Doll Collection. Um, I'll leave the style on the screen. They're two for 15. I'm sorry, not two for 15. They're one for 15, two for 25. Um, but yeah, so I'm about to go in and highlight my face. Even though I already look highlighted, you know? That's just, that's just that melanin for you. That did that melanin. That's just a melon, the melon. Y'all, my birthday is in a few days. My birthday is in a few days, and I really don't know what the heck I'm gonna do for my birthday. Ain't that sad? I have nothing to do with my birthday because it's damn quarantine. Yeah, I wasn't. I wanted to go to freaking um Paris. I was gonna go to Paris for my birthday, honestly, but I can't do that anymore because I'm not going over there right now. Anyway, I'll probably go next year though, honestly. Definitely go next year. But um, yeah, that's a wrap for the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, make sure you check out my next video because I am going to start, like I said, my business series, my entrepreneur series. So definitely, definitely, definitely check it out. I hope, hopefully I was entertaining because like I said, my cousin said I'm very boring on camera and I'm not a boring person. I'm actually very fun. I'm not a boring as a bitch. Uh, I'll see y'all in my next video. I need to go and straighten my hair off camera because this know what why she keep doing is the man <laughs> i don't know but sis we we done okay this is your everyday makeup routine for the summertime if you want to be sweat proof all of that but make sure you prime i didn't put any primer on or you didn't see me put any primer on in the video but make sure you prime um in the summertime that's going to prevent all that sweating and oiliness and you know your makeup sliding off so make sure you moisturize and prime do not skip moisturizer a lot of people think you don't have to moisturize your skin in the summer but that is a myth you need to moisturize your skin all the time 
Um, I'm going to try to find a moisturizer that has SPF in it. I haven't found anyone or found one that makes me look, that doesn't make me look gray. So if y'all know one that is melanin friendly and um, doesn't make you look gray, definitely point me in that direction because I do need a SPF, a uh, moisturizer with SPF in it. So, you know, prevent me from aging. I think that's what that does. But yeah, um, if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next mother banging video. Period. There's a game. There's a game. <laughs> Hopefully I'm not throwing up any game signs because I